Hey there everyone, this is Danielle playing some Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Last time we got into Hooktail's castle here and we discovered that its weakness is a creature beating with fur and ending with og. I wonder what that could be. <laughs> uh, also we figured out that this guy was not Coops' father, even though we thought that he might have been. I guess that's a dungeon beyond us. Ick, there are bones scattered everywhere. Mmm, mold and dust. Great. You could totally choke on the stench in this place. Ah, oh yeah, I already read that. <laughs> uh, I read that in the last video. I believe this guy's gonna attack us. Laugh, half, half, half. You clearly don't value your lives much if you've come to this castle to disturb us. You will go no further, and from this moment on, you'll be nothing but bones. Oh my god. Bones, bones, bones. What's with the what's with these numbskulls? Ow, ow! Watch it, pushy. They're shoving me around, Mario. What should we do? Can't flee this fight. Um. That's not good. Um, get paddling. That's a dull bones, sort of a skeleton thing. It was a Koopa Trooper, once. Max HP is 1, attack is 2, and defense is 1. These creeps throw bones to attack. Oh, and they build reinforcements too. Attacks that can strike multiple dull bones at once are the most effective. Yeah, we have to use Power Shell, but before we do that, I want to tattle on everyone, so... It may take a little while. Oh yeah, Happy Heart. Thanks, Happy Heart. Uh, let me see. If I switch and tattle, and then I can switch... Oop, that's Dull Bones. Oops. Ah, oh, dang it. Yeah, I read that a moment ago. Uh, special... Yeah, let's do a sweet treat. Why not? Okay, there we go. Now we're going to tattle on the red bones, and then we're going to switch to Coops. <laughs> That's a red bones. The book says that it's a reanimated Koopa skeleton stained red with... Oh, um, well, you don't need to know what it's stained with. Max HP is 5, attack is 3, and defense is 1. Unlike your average dull bones, even if you pound it to 0 HP and it crumbles, it totally might revive, like a zombie. My advice is to get rid of all the dull bones, then attack the red bones. Oh, and one more thing. Once its friends start to fall, it may create some more. Okay, now that we're Mario, we're going to switch our partner to Koops. And then we'll get attacked again. And then next turn, we can actually use Koops as power shell. Kinda wasted a lot of time there because I want to tattle everything. <laughs> Power Shell is good. <laughs> um, it's going to follow up with a Power Smash, and that should deal with this guy. Oh, almost. There we go, job's done. Nice and some points. <laughs> Okay, now we can continue. Let's go. Um, and yeah, there'll be some more dull bones walking around now. You've got a Shine Sprite, a mysterious powerful object. Collecting these will help. Uh, yeah, Shine Sprites are very useful. We can't use them just yet, but once we have them, we'll be able to make use of them later. So, good to get. Uh, we've got a bit of a puzzle here by the looks of things. Ah, yes. 
Uh, I believe what we do is we go over here, down on top of that purple block while Coops is in the right spot, and up we go. <laughs> oh, a star piece. Uh, can we get off, off of this, or is that side path that I found by accident? Might just be a side path I found by accident. Um, alright. Okay, let's do this again. Okay, so let's drop here, but we can also drop down and... No, we can't break that. Okay. You can jump over and use the hammer though, right? Yes. Um, okay, and then we can get that to move up. No? Did I hit it wrong? There we go. And then I'll get that out of the way. We can hit the red switch now by throwing coops at it. Okay. I can do simple puzzles. <laughs> Now the stairs go the other way. And we can get the key. You got a castle key. Off we go. Here's a save block. I'll be a good save block. Track down a save, there we go. You struck first, da 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 Take that, Goomba! Oh no, more flying enemies. Oh, Coops, I'm sorry. Well, if we mount it, multi-bounce will get them down pretty easily. There we go, no longer they're flying enemies. They're now regular enemies. They're gonna dizzy dial us, aren't they? Yeah. Okay, we're doing fine, we're doing fine. Okie dokie. Now, we can get a dizzy dial. Uh, do we have any mushrooms? We do have mushrooms. Uh, let's toss the dizzy dial. Use a mushroom. And then grab the dizzy dial. Once we have empty space for it. There we go. Do, 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 it opens the gate, but not for long. Oh, hello. Looks familiar. What the heck? Hey, guests! It's been a long time since anyone came here. A real long time. Huh? You heard me? Wow. Wait a sec, if you can hear my voice, you must be some legendary hero or something. Or not. To be honest, I'm sure anyone with ears can hear me. But it sure is fun zinging people with that whole legendary hero bit. Hey, but seriously folks, I was wondering if you could let me out of this chest. Uh, I've been locked in here so long, I'm starting to cramp up like you wouldn't believe. All you have to do is find the key and let me out. Easy. Huh? What do you mean? You think you'd be cursed if you opened the box? Ridiculous! Who would do that, really? Wait in a box and curse, folks? A real slime ball, that's who. I'm not a real slime ball, and I would do no such thing, but that should be obvious. Look, if you help me out, maybe I'll help you out. You know, a little 
I scratch your back, you scratch mine, except in reverse order. Of course, you don't have to- you don't have to if you really don't want to. Like, finding a key is hard. Yeah, we do need to open that chest and get cursed. Got a black key. A strange black key, but what could it be for? Um, M Mario, l look at that! Oh god. Oh, I don't like the look of this. Come on, run! Run, 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 run. As you can see, yeah, it's not actually difficult. <laughs> Man, that was too close. Gotta shake it off. Whew. Okay, we got the key, so let's go open that spooky chest. Oh. Hey there, boy am I so glad you found that key. Unbelievable. Which item? Black key. Wee! Fools! Yeah, it's another demon who's gonna curse us, obviously. Why, only the most idiotic pudding brain dolt would fall for a scheme like that! The castle's trapped to prevent anyone who's entered this place from ever leaving it! No matter which path you take, you're fated to waste away to a slow, painful end. But wait, there's more to this great deal. I'll throw in a free curse. No charge. Oogly oogly boo! Wee <laughs> Now you're cursed, doofus, and it serves you right. This curse is more cursedly curseworthy than any curse that's ever cursed you. Or this curse makes you like a piece of paper when you press and hold R. Wee <laughs> What a curse. Who curses like me? No one. Now I shall show you just how frightful a curse it is. Go on, press and hold R. Press and hold R now. You idiot! Press and hold R! Press and hold R and be ashamed! <laughs> Just look at yourself! How embarrassing for you! Eat a sandwich, skinny! He. <laughs> you understand what this curse means for you? Yes. Then farewell, you dumbbells! <laughs> yeah, we've been cursed with another very useful ability. Um... But that's cool. <laughs> Basically, the way th reason this curse is useful is because you can walk through narrow spaces by turning sideways. <laughs> Pretty simple, really. We need this as well. Attack FXR. That's a very important badge. Uh, I think it's free to equip, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. There we go. It only changes the sound effects of Mario's attacks, but that's actually very helpful for us, and you'll see why shortly. Maybe not shortly. You'll see why when we get to the part where it's relevant, but it's it's in this area of the game. <laughs> you probably noticed another little jump cut there. Uh, the game crashed again, so we're going to record for about 15 minutes, and we're going to splice that together with the previous bit. I don't super remember where we were at, uh, because it was actually a while ago when I was playing the first half of this video. <laughs> Uh, but I believe we were going to come over here and hit this. Let me just have a look at our badges to help remind me where we're at. I did have a peek at the other video just to make sure, but... Uh, I think we're up to this. Nope, we haven't got the key yet. Okay, okay, now I know where we're at. Uh, we also can't reach that yet. We'll be getting that later. Uh... Da, da, da. Hopefully Dolphin will crash less and less as we progress, because I'm updating the software, getting new versions that should be more stable, that kind of thing. We'll see how we go. Oh, that's what happens if you get hit by it. Nothing. I was wondering about that. Okay, um, let's head this way. I probably should have watched the video a bit more thoroughly to be sure of where we're at, but I think we'll be okay. Have we done this yet? I don't know. Oh, we've done that much. Oop. Oh gosh. Where are we up to? <laughs> Let me check what key items we have. That's don't you remember. Uh, just the mailbox. Okay, so we haven't got any keys yet. Sorry. 
I am woefully unprepared for this video that we are now watching. I'll put this to this side. What can I get to over there? Oh yeah, there was a key over there, I think. I think. Well, let's just proceed forward and hopefully I'll find something I remember. Oh, jeez. Game doesn't really good, do a good job of reminding you if you have to restart in the middle of, middle of playback. Uh, I think this room was already visited. Yeah, we already went in here. And I believe this is where we got the badge, actually. Oop. Oh, battle time. Uh, always good to do a quick battle, because uh, then we can maybe level up some stuff, which is nice. Uh, Multi-bounce. Sounds good. Oh, really? Multi-bounce did sound good, but I messed it up, so now it sounds bad. <sighs> I am out of practice for these action commands. Oh, gosh. Oh, my goodness. Let's try this again. That's more like it. Uh, the blocks aren't working quite right, but the other part worked okay. Oh, jeez. You can hear Mario's making little little froggy noises each time he jumps on something now. Uh, because of the sound effects badge we have equipped. Same thing with his hammer. Okay. That didn't go super well, but we got a fire flower. Uh... Uh, we don't have room for a fire flower. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, okay, where do we need to go next? I think back here we might be able to do something. I'm going to hit save again. Um, hopefully I don't have to do a shorter bit of video if I crash again, but hopefully I won't crash again, so we'll see how we go. Okay. Uh, here we go. Boop. Boop. Okay, so that's what those do. Oh, right. Uh, I've already done this in the first half. I hope I didn't. Because uh, that would be awkward. And release. Yeah, there's something over there we haven't got yet. Can't reach it, though. The chances are we can't get to that just yet. Hmm. We already do this one? Sorry, I really ought to watch the whole video just to make sure I didn't I remembered exactly where we were up to, but I didn't. Because I don't really like hearing my own voice. Um Yeah. Is that a good reason? <laughs> I really hope that's a good reason. Um God, I've completely forgotten what you're supposed to do here. Uh, try going further back this way, see if there's something else we need to do in an earlier room. Oh, right. Look, there's a key. Okay. Okay. We're on track now. Because we can do this to walk through these bars, and then we get the key. Okay. The castle key. A key that opens a door in Hooktail Castle. Uh, you might remember that there was a locked door elsewhere in the castle. It was this direction. Da, 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 da. Oh, okay. Battle time. Um, I'm kind of low on stats, so this isn't really ideal. Uh, let's hammer. They have one health, but they have one defense, so you have to do two damage in one hit in order to actually hurt them. So doing a jump does not work, but doing a hammer does work. Uh, we can use Sweet Treat again, so that's, that's something. Oh, uh, hello. <laughs> There's more of them, okay. Um, does Power Shell still do two damage? Because if it does, that'd just take out everyone. I'm not sure. Uh, do I have something that can... No, I haven't got anything that replenishes flower points. Okay, uh, except for Sweet Treat, which we could try. Let's go to shot.
Okay. Well, that worked. Okay, we now can afford to do a power shell. It does. It does do two damage. Excellent. And dropped a flower point as well. That's helpful. Okay. Um. Anyway, we're going to head back to that locked door we saw at the start of this part of the video. <laughs> yeah, the, the crashing thing is really inconvenient. Uh, let's save again. I love to save. It's my favorite. Uh, then we're gonna jump up here. We're gonna whack this. Bring this down. We're gonna head back up. Oops. Like so. And that lets us enter this door that is locked. Excellent. <laughs> oh, healing. Yes, please. Oh, thank you so much, healing. Uh, let me see. It does cost six coins, but it's totally worth it. Boop. I'm not sure if I mentioned yet, but in the first Paper Mario they had heart blocks like this, but the heart blocks were free instead of costing a certain number of coins to use. So that's an interesting change. Um, in Bug Fables, like, the healing also ends up costing money, so, hmm. A lovely piece of a star, thank you star piece. Here we go. <laughs> Oh gosh. <sighs> well, uh, let me see if I hammer this one, and then uh, we throw a shell at the back one, that should be fine. We may even get the fire flower. I don't think they drop, they give you the items they drop, but we'll see. <laughs> okay, we're good. Uh, hop, hop, hop. Here we want to stand over here. Chuck Coops over there. Bring him back. Okay, we definitely want that shroom that we just passed. Uh, to get that though, we're gonna have to time ourselves a little bit better. Uh, this attack is pretty easy. Uh, it's just gotta hit them both with something that won't get spiked. Like a hammer. Or a power shell. Keltos works too. Easy peasy. If you had Gumbella out, you'd have a bit of a problem there, because Gumbella is not really equipped for this sort of thing. Uh. Hey, Ms. Mouse. Uh, this encounter is optional. I believe you don't have to come in here. Uh, but Ms. Mouse is here, and we can meet her, so... Huh? Oh my. Who is this handsome piece of cheese? I can't believe there are other thieves here besides me. How very strange. Hey, who are you? Me? Why, I'm Ms. Mouse, the globe-trotting thief. Heard of me, sweetie? I heard there were rare and valuable badges here in this castle. That's why I'm here. But the real question is, why are people like you roaming in such a rundown place? Um, well, you see, we're here to beat Hooktail and get the, um, Crystal Star. So, don't think we'll let you get the crystal star first, no matter how cute you are. He is very cute. Crystal star, you say? Mm-hmm-hmm. -hmm. I didn't know a thing like that was hidden in this castle. Sounds intriguing. Perhaps I just heard something you didn't want me hearing? Mm-hmm-hmm. -hmm. Darn. Oh, but that's okay. I mean, you were looking for this crystal star first. And I already found the badge I was after, so I'll let you get your crystal star. Um, hey, what's that supposed to mean? Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Means I must say bye-bye for now, Mr. Cutie. I know, it's sad. We just met and already it is time to say farewell. Alas. Oh my, you're so bold. Is that legal? Oh, I almost forgot. I have a little secret to share with you. Somewhere in this castle is a badge that'll help you best hook tail, or so I've heard. I don't know what kind of badge it is. Maybe you found it already? Maybe not. 
If you're going to fight Hooktown, I'd recommend finding that badge first. Well, take care, handsome mustache man. Let's get together again real soon. I wonder what her story is. But it's an interesting one, full of romance. Okay, so the thing she stole from this chest, I think we can get it later in the game, but we can't get it for a while. We can open these other chests though. A honey syrup, we do want a honey syrup in our collection. Let's uh, let's replace the mystery because there's not very little chance I'm gonna use that. Uh, what, else, what else is here? Mushroom, I do want a mushroom. Let's change it up for uh, the courage shell. I'm probably not gonna use the courage shell. And I think the last one is a key. Or maybe the encounter's required. Actually, yeah, you, you need the key. Yeah, you have to come into this room to get the key. <laughs> That's right. Oh, uh, we get a shine sprite. Is that the first one? I don't remember. Shine sprite's two. Okay, so I've already explained what they do because I've gotten one before. Uh, okay. I think that's all we need to do here for now. Checking the menus, see what we're at. Uh, what level are we? We're at level four. Okay, so that means we've all up three times, so next we want another HP increase. Okay. Okay, so yeah, the important thing there is getting the key, but we also get to meet Ms. Mouse and get some other stuff. I think we just drop off of here? Nope, that doesn't work. Uh, I want to get that, uh, that special shroom back there. It, it is a lot better than a regular shroom. You will see why once we manage to get our, our little hands on it. Yeah, a life shroom. Restores 10 HP when Mario or his partner falls. So basically, if you lose the battle, these bring you back with an HP, which is pretty great. Uh, well, like a fairy in Zelda. Uh, I'll ditch a fire flower. I don't need that many. Damn it! <laughs> Go away, fire flower. <laughs> okay, and then there's a locked door on this side, so we do need to use the key we just got to open that. Uh, okay, we're gonna want a multi bounce to get both of these guys down, like so. Uh, then we can toss shell. There we go. Okay, you're gonna use a courage shell. That ups your defense by three. That's kind of a lot, but okay. That's not doing any damage. Um, let's just try normal attacks until the shell wears off, I guess. They shouldn't be able to attack us because they've fallen over. There we go, it's now worn off, so we can now attack normally. Julio Fiends. Okay, uh, how are we doing for time? Ooh, we're about 15 minutes recorded now, so I should probably wrap this video up, because we're starting with about 15 minutes worth of footage. Uh, hopefully there'll be a save point near here-ish. Uh, I may need to backtrack a bit in order to save. He struck first. Okay, again we want Oh, we want a power bounce here. Uh right, multi bounce so that we can knock over both of those troopers in the back. Like so. Uh, then we toss a power shell. Play after everyone in one go. Ah, I'm not good at the the inner thingy. There we go. Job done. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba uh, that gets us a bit more health, which is nice to have. Uh, then we want to toss this over here. Uh, it's another one of these little puzzles with coops and held in place as we do stuff. Now let's just walk on these tiny little ledges. There's a couple of things we can do here. First, we're gonna twirl through, walk all the way over to the other side. 
so. Then we stay on this little ledge in order to get a star piece. And we bring ourselves back. Uh, get back on this little ledge here. And we can glide our way over to the door. Easy peasy. <laughs> okay, we are now in a room with a stairway. A couple things we can do here. Get the next castle key, then we want to drop down. Get last stampede. That's the badge we saw earlier. Uh, because we've just got that badge, we can actually go down here as... Well, not because we've got the badge, but because we're in the room where the badge is, we can go down here. And down here is a save point. Which is a great place to stop. <laughs> and we'll be able to get back up because the yellow block is now in position. I think. Am I correct about that? Actually, I don't think there's a way to make it go back up, so I may be incorrect. We may have to loop around again. That's okay, though. Um, I'm going to call that a video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope the disruption of me not recording for a really long time between videos and doing a half video and... All that didn't mess things up too badly. Um, I know it's not ideal, but when Dolphin crashes and then you get frustrated and have to stop playing because Dolphin crashed, that's just sort of what happens. <sighs> Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, hopefully, we'll get to record for a full half hour without a crash so that it doesn't get interrupted and it just gets to keep going normally. <laughs> Thanks. Um, bye!